Hi there, here we are with our patient Gallo who came in for a one year uh, post-operative visit. Uh, Gallo had two previous procedures uh, with other physicians and had uh, limited results. So he came into our office uh, for basically a corrective procedure. Uh, we did one of the Max Harvest hair transplant procedure in Gallo one year ago and uh, we're going to show you the results. Alright, so here's what we did. So what we did is we uh, redid the entire hairline all the way around. We put all these soft little grafts in so it went into nice and soft and nice and natural. We reframed it the entire way around and got in front of his old existing grafts and then we built in with some stronger ones. Okay, so I started all the way from over here. You'll notice this tiny little line right here, this little white line, is the suture line. Okay, so I took this all the way around and you can see this fine trace line. Okay, this running through here is the suture line that I left Galo and then this goes all the way across. You can see it clearly here. And then this continues to go all the way around. Now I'm going to stop here because now I'm going to show you what other doctors did to Galo. Okay, this is what he had, Galo had when he had his last procedure at another doctor's office. So that's what they left him. Now you'll notice that there's hair here and hair here and then you have this voided area here with no hair. So now let's go back to where our scar is. Our scar is up here where you can see this fine trace line. Now I'm going to just have it followed all the way around. So this is our scar up top. That's our scar right there, this little white line here. And I'm going to show you all the way around our scar and then we're going to show you his previous scar. Okay, so this is what we left our patient. Okay, that's what we left our patient. Now, let's show you some previous work from his other doctor. So this is what happened in the other facility. If you were to take this and cut this, shave that down, you'd have a big void area without any hair in it. We have so many patients that come in. Our patients are flying in from across right now, literally the world, from Canada, Alaska, China. They come in from all over seeking out what we're doing because we're leaving these undetectable suture lines and delivering these results in that one procedure.